The UK has denied WikiLeaks founder Julian Assange permission to appeal against an order that allowed his extradition to the US. In December 2021, after assurances by American authorities that Assange would not face severe treatment, the British High Court overturned a lower court's decision and paved the way for his extradition. Assange's lawyers argued that the US's assurance of prison conditions was not presented to the district judge, who had refused the US's original extradition application by warning that American prison conditions may lead to Assange committing suicide. However, the Supreme Court said that the petition failed to raise an arguable point of law. Assange's lawyers say he is being punished for publishing truthful and newsworthy information, and will now consider launching a final appeal. Various rights groups have said that the decision is proof of the United States' aim of curbing media freedoms and freedom of expression. They have also said that it is unlikely that Assange's safety concerns will be heard, pointing to a report that the US has previously considered kidnapping or killing Assange while he was taking refuge in the Ecuadorian embassy in London. In 2006, Assange founded WikiLeaks, a platform through which he leaked several documents targeting political leaders, governments, and corporations from the US, Europe, China, Africa, and the Middle East. It first made headlines in 2010 after releasing information on atrocities committed by guards at the Guantanamo Bay prison. Assange has also been accused of conspiring with former US military intelligence analyst Chelsea Manning to leak around 500,000 documents that uncovered corruption and war crimes, particularly by the Allied and American forces in Afghanistan and Iraq. Fearing arrest following the massive leak, Assange fled to the Ecuadorian embassy in London in 2012 to avoid extradition, and was subsequently granted asylum and then citizenship in January 2018. However, ties between Assange and Ecuador later frayed, leading to his citizenship being rescinded and his asylum status being revoked. He was then arrested by British police in 2019. The district judge will now hear other arguments, following which Home Secretary Preeti Patel will make the final call.